Alright guys, this is option one on how to create your own website. Option one, this is not what you always have to use. There's other options out there with free websites that you can make your own website. Now the first one I'll be showing right now is called Wix. Wix runs on Flash. If you don't know what Flash is, it's what gives you all these shiny effects. You see that? It has a glossy uh, effect right on the button and whatnot that comes up here. Let's say I click on this. It gives a certain effect to it. If you click on it, you notice the loading circle, and it'll do it like that. If it lags for you, it depends on your graphics card or how much your computer can handle. So basically, to make your own website, just go ahead and click on Start Now. I already created my own account, so go ahead and, and uh, follow up on their settings and to create your own account. You will be prompt to make your own website and create your own website. Let me just go and click on Create, and it shall load this it'll give you a category to choose what kind of template you want and what style you want your website to be some are free mainly most of them are free but if you want the best you have to pay for it right now it's loading it for me bear with me I have slow internet so you can go ahead and view it let's say this because it looks pretty much good for tech and whatever you can use this for home use or for business and personal use and this is how the website will look like you can go ahead and edit it but first right now we're viewing it this is how everything will work you can edit the transitions between everything here just like the transition effect and it has good stability but it's not the best because sometimes it might end up wrong at some occasions like it'll crash at times when the flash gets overloaded if you have myspace or anything else open and yeah you can just go ahead and make your own edit you just click on that up there a window like this should pop up depending on your internet it should load so you should wait once you have it open it should say welcome to Wix editor and just follow the pop-up things on tutorials it's basically easy to use I don't have to show you everything just a little bit you know you can move around things just click and let's say news here and click on edit you can change the text give it a transition effect under this but just go ahead and follow the tutorial and you should have it easy like that now this is the first option on how to create your own website with Wix it runs on flash so yeah that's basically it now let me show you my website which is pretty cool I mean uh, pretty dull at times cuz yeah okay now the downside of this is when you post your link like mine it goes like this you have to like give a name at it and it's super long they don't go like micro helper period webs period dot com it's pretty long and that's what I hate about it but I like it because the website runs good and it gives you all these special effects let's say I hover over these and it's easy to use because it runs on flash as I said sometimes flash crashes but with the improving Adobe product everything should be going well there's my Twitter Facebook and let's say you click on ah shoot <laughs> like bio I just click on that and it gives a transition effect when you click on either of these links so as it loads it does it fade out fade in effect and this is how I customize my website so this is how you create a website for yourself this is option one and I'll be showing some more options with different websites so please enjoy this, try it out. It's easy for me, but the downside is the website link if you create your own because it pretty much sucks. I mean, look at that. Micro helper slash one, which everybody cannot remember. Uh, but yeah, try it out. Thank you for watching this video, and please subscribe for the upcoming tutorials.